वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम 1.15 सो स्टेटमेंट इज व्हेन द फोर्स पी रीच्ड 8 किलो न्यूटन द वुडन स्पेसिमन शोन फेल्ड इन शेयर अलोंग द सरफेस इंडिकेटेड बाय डैश लाइन डिटरमाइन द एवरेज शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस अलोंग दैट सरफेस एट दैट टाइम ऑफ फेलियर सो यू कैन सी दिस इज द लोड पी दैट इज अप्लाइड दैट इज टेंसाइल लोड 8 किलो न्यूटन and it is given that uh, due to this load the wooden specimen shown failed on this dash line clear so you have to determine the shear force along that failure so let's start with the uh, given data so we have been given that p is equal to 8 kilo newton clear and what we have to find is that we have to find the sharing stress sharing stress ta along the dash line which cause failure so what we will do is that uh, you can see that this is the length if i draw it like this clear and the width is given as 15 mm so width is 15 so it will be like it will be like this this is uh, the area shear area and that is equal to 15 multiplied by 90 and that is 30 50 square millimeter and the shear force acting on this area will be this will be equal to p and that is given as 8 kilo newton so solution is that uh area being shared area being shared where this failure caused is equal to 15 mm multiply by 90 mm and that is equal to 1350 square millimeter and the load which is 8 kilo newton so 8 into 10 to the power 3 newton so we know that sharing stress is equal to shear force divided by shear area so force is given 8 into 10 to the power 3 newton divided by area is 30 50 square millimeter so you will get um 5.93 okay let me clear one more thing is that Uh, this 8 into 10 to the power 3 newton and if you convert it into meter so 30 50 into 10 to the power minus 6 square meter so you will get the shearing stress comes out to be 5.39 so you will get the answer will be 5925 2592.92 and the unit will be pascal so if you convert it into mega pascal so shearing stress will be equal to 5.92 into 10 to the power 6 pascal and that will be equal to 5.92 mega pascal so 5.92 mega pascal is the answer for this question this is the shearing stress every shearing stress along the surface at the time of failure and that was all about problem 1.15 taken from mechanics of material by bear and johnson 6 edition i hope you have enjoyed this video those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and hit the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest video If you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching